Well, as we all know that Sony is an industry leader in a wide variety of product categories, including batteries, electronic devices, audio, optics, entertainment, displays, televisions, and a great deal more home appliances. And joining hands with Honda to beat Tesla, well, it's true, the road will never be the same. Also a great plan to buckle up in the race of who rules the EV market. You're watching Tech Addicts, which is a plus point for all you viewers, as we provide the latest updates of the automobile industry. So, let's get going. At the Consumer Electronics Show, or CES, in 2020, Sony startled the globe by exhibiting a concept for an electric vehicle called Vision S. Sony affirmed that it was simply in the testing phase and had no plans to commercialize the product. As a concept car, the Vision S was a very impressive automobile. Sony was unable to independently develop an electric vehicle due to their extremely little competence in the automobile manufacturing industry. However, Sony has just surprised everyone by announcing the launch of a new electric vehicle brand called Afila in collaboration with Honda. The production version of the Afila is an electric sedan, exactly like the Vision S concept car. Officially confirming that it will debut its brand new electric vehicle at the annual CES in Las Vegas on January 4th, Sony Honda Mobility, which is a joint venture between Sony and Honda, has said that it will make the announcement. The partnership anticipates beginning manufacturing of its first electric vehicle in 2026, with a primary concentration on the manufacture for the North American market as well as online sales in that region. After that, we will start in Europe, then go on to Japan as our second market. In conjunction with the announcement, Sony has also provided a teaser image. On the other hand, the teaser photograph does not offer a particularly clear view of the figure. It is anticipated that Sony and Honda will show off a new electric vehicle concept outfitted with Level 3 autonomous driving capabilities. Sony Honda Mobility has claimed that the vehicle may be capable of autonomous driving at Level 3 under some conditions and Level 2 Plus within a wider variety of scenarios. However, many features have not yet been confirmed. The company also has hinted that there would be additional capabilities added to the vehicle in the form of a subscription service that can be purchased separately. There have also been rumors that the entertainment system of the vehicle may incorporate a fully functional version of the PlayStation 5. According to recent reports, the upcoming EVs that will be offered by Sony Honda Mobility will be offered in the premium EV segment. This indicates that even though these may not be exactly affordable for mass market consumption, there is a chance that the products could undercut those from luxury car brands. Sony's been given the responsibility of supplying the software system that is housed within the EVs. Additionally, Sony will be in charge of providing cloud-based services and in-car entertainment alternatives. A combined venture between Sony and Honda will see Honda contributing its expertise in car manufacturing as well as its engineering talents. It is not completely apparent at this time whether Honda or Sony Honda Mobility will be in charge of providing after-sales assistance. The first vehicle to be manufactured by the joint venture will be available for pre-order in the first half of the year 2025, according to an announcement made by SHM. The Vision S02 was Sony's second idea for an electric vehicle, which the company displayed earlier this year at the 2022 edition of the CES. Following the announcement that Sony and Honda intended to manufacture and market electric automobiles in collaboration, the two firms have now unveiled a prototype of the vehicle, which will be marketed under the brand name Afila. At the Consumer Electronics Show on Wednesday, a four-door sedan was driven on stage while Sony CEO Kenichiro Yoshida discussed the company's mobility philosophy, which emphasizes the development of vehicles that are capable of driving themselves and can be transformed into moving entertainment spaces. According to Yoshida, the first pre-orders of the Afilas are expected to begin in the first half of 2025, and sales are expected to get underway that same year. Beginning in the spring of 26, initial shipments will be sent to clients located in North America. Both Sony and Honda have stated in the past that the new electric vehicle will initially be produced at a facility owned by Honda in North America and will be able to perform the capabilities of Level 3 automated driving in certain scenarios. In a car with Level 3 autonomy, the human driver is still required to take control of the vehicle whenever the system asks it. This level of autonomy allows the vehicle to drive in conditions such as traffic jams. 
Today, Sony disclosed additional facts regarding the design of the vehicle, one of which was the incorporation of external media along the front of the car, which gives the vehicle the ability to communicate with other drivers and pass on relevant information. Yoshida shared their plans, saying, We aim on exploring the idea of how media may generate a pleasant and engaging mobility interaction. According to Yoshida, the prototype also includes 45 cameras and sensors that are located both inside and outside the car to assure the utmost level of safety and security. And cabin sensors will be used to monitor the driver's condition to reduce the likelihood of accidents. Yoshida stated that Afila will provide the highest quality entertainment available to its patrons. The Sony Honda Joint Venture plans to integrate the Unreal Engine, a 3D computer graphics game engine developed by Epic Games, into their automobiles. This will help visualize not just the enjoyment that can be found in automobiles, but also communication and safety. According to Kim Labriri, Chief Technology Officer of Epic Games, the most natural method to visualize crucial data within the car is through intuitive interactive photo real augmentation. This is something that Unreal Engine excels at, thus it is a perfect choice. Afila cars will be built around Qualcomm's system-on-chip technology, including their Snapdragon digital chassis, to handle all the computing that is required for automated driving and advanced driver assistance system capabilities, car telematics, and what we expect to be a tricked-out infotainment system. This will allow the cars to handle everything from automated driving to car telematics. The incorporation of PlayStation and a digital display that runs across the width of the car's interior are just two of the many elements that will make you scratch your head when you see them on this vehicle. Although PlayStation 5 shipments are still low around the globe, Sony is planning to include the console in their upcoming automobiles. Sony is well aware of the significance of subscription services due to the fact that entertainment is one of its core businesses. It has been rumored that Afila Automobiles will also feature a system with similar capabilities. Many of the more notable features might be accessible only through the purchase of a subscription, similar to how Tesla Automobiles include the hardware for autopilot as standard equipment, but the feature is only activated once the customers paid for it. Specifications and Cost Concerning the Afila electric automobile prototype, it's not a lot of information that is currently available. It's anticipated that there will be a big battery with a capacity of approximately 100 kilowatt hours, a range of approximately 500 kilometers on a single charge, and an electrifying acceleration. The installation of high-tech sensors, cameras, LiDAR sensors, and radar modules at strategic points in a vehicle paves the way for semi-autonomous driving and, in the not-too-distant future, fully autonomous driving. The production-ready version of the Afila sedan EV is now undergoing testing, and it will compete directly with other high-end electric sedans such as the Mercedes-Benz EQS, the Porsche Taycan, the Tesla Model S, and Lucid Air. Prices for top-of-the-line vehicles are anticipated to be greater than $100,000. Well, indeed, Honda, the power of dreams. That's all for today's video. Do hit the like button and subscribe to our channel.